morning people uh, today is Sunday <laughs> <laughs> I am currently in Bath visiting the sister we have the whole family here we have mum David Ethan and obviously Becca uh, so yeah we're just currently in Becca's flat me and Becca slept in her flatmates uh, room and then mum David and Ethan slept in her room as it's just nice and cozier say hello mum Hello. Yesterday we went to the Christmas market, uh, just spent the day walking around doing a bit of shopping. Um, I did some filming there and I didn't introduce the video yesterday, so that's why I'm doing it now. Um, so I will put all of the market footage in for you now. I'll probably put some music over that um, because I didn't film too much as I wanted to enjoy the day. And we didn't actually talk at all yesterday. So last night we also went out for a meal, went for a lovely Italian at a place called Ask Italian, which was nice. Um, and then today we're just going to chill out, probably do some more shopping as Christmas is coming up very, very, very soon. And then I'm going to head back to Birmingham later on this afternoon and get some work done at uni um, as it's getting a bit, getting a bit hectic recently. So yeah, enjoy the video, make sure you like it, subscribe and yeah.
plug link in the description what are you saying beautiful day Good morning we are just heading off to get some bacon, eggs, sausages, beans for a big old, big old fry up. Good morning, Mumsy. Good morning. Hello. Bacon down there. Does it open? Eggies. Coins. Oh, okay. Raw food. Um, we don't have a taste, so you have to do it in the... This looks lovely, thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. So we are just currently walking around <coughs> looking at the sites in Bath. Um, just looking at the original buildings that haven't yet been changed, whereas everything else in Bath has all been changed. What's this meant to be, Mum? A crescent. <coughs> a what? It's an old crescent erected in 1754. <laughs> I thought that said directed. <laughs> oh dear. Becca, what's this? They're millions. Can you wear your crescent? Yeah, what is that? It's like one of the most expensive places to live in Bath. Nice. We'll have to redo it. <laughs> Wait. Right, so I've just arrived back in Birmingham after a long road trip from Bath. Today I actually splashed some cash. I went to Route 1, which was a very bad decision because it's just a recipe for disaster when I'm in that shop because I just love everything in there. Um, there's not that many stores around UK, usually it's an online shop, but when I see one in person I've got to splash the cash. So I ended up buying two pairs of shoes and a new jumper. One of the shoes I'm actually going to be getting for my uh, Christmas present off my mum, so I won't be seeing them until Christmas Day. Uh, but I'll quickly show you what I do have with me. I'm just, I'm gassed because it's just. So I'll quickly show that now. So here I have an oversized polar sweater. Um, if you don't know what polar is, it's a, it's a skateboard company. And as you guys have probably t noticed, that I do like to wear my skater clothes. So very, very soft on the inside. I love the color and I love the print. Something different for once, uh, better than black, which I normally wear. Uh, so yeah, this was quite pricey. It was 78 pounds, which is not ideal. I'm gonna be taking that off straight away. But yeah, this is the jumper I bought. And then here we have 
Some bushnets. I've always wanted a pair of bushnets, but I've always been slightly against their. Like they've, they've always had a um, a big lip here. Um, usually they stick out quite a bit. But I actually saw these pair, this pair in the, sh uh, in the shop. Um, I think they're actually they're called bushnet Volk, um, which are slightly different. I think it's just the ones without the big lip. Um, just some skater shoes. Absolutely love them. Uh, different colour to what I'd normally wear. As these are getting absolutely ruined now. So yeah, absolutely in love with these. Love them so much. And that is £150 worth of, of clothes. Two items. I'd quickly just like to say that I've really enjoyed this weekend. Um, it was really good to spend some quality time with my family. Um, as I spend a lot of time at uni, I stress myself out a lot because I just wind myself up with the amount of work I've got. Um, I never really have time to just chill out and just have some fun, um, enjoy my life um, because I'm always stressed out and tired and just not in an ideal mood. Don't know why I'm holding masking tape. But yeah, it was really nice to spend some quality time with the family this weekend. I made sure that I worked really hard this week so I could have the weekend off and just forget about the uni stuff. But now I'm back in Birmingham. I'm gonna be spending my evening at uni, of course, um, doing some more work. And then the next two weeks are gonna be hectic. So I'm gonna smash it out, no complaints, and then just have Christmas off and then get back on it in the new year. So on that note, I think we're gonna end the video here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, make sure you subscribe like I mentioned last time it's halted a bit recently so hit the subscribe button down there and make sure you like the video can we please try and hit let's say 30 likes um, for you guys that have reached this point in the video so yeah thanks so much for watching I'm going to be filming tomorrow as I'm hitting the gym in the morning so yeah I'll see you next time Subscribe to Thomas Roundtree, legend. <laughs>